Well, hey there, it's time for West Texas Wild once again. Ray Matlack, West Texas A&M University, and talking about a uh, type of arachnid today, right? Right. Fun with black lights is what we're going to talk about today. Um, we went out uh, a week ago, and we had one of our nice warm nights, and we took a black light out to Caprock Canyons, and we shined it on the ground, and you'd be amazed at what you'd find with a black light. Um, not, a, not a rock and roll poster or anything like that, but what you see now on the monitor is that scorpions, arachnid, um, will fluoresce under UV radiation, under UV light. And so we found within probably half an hour, um, well over a dozen scorpions. They're that abundant around here. Wow, that might scare a few people from going to Caprock. Well, <laughs> let me just tell you, if you have other, other favorite places in Texas, no matter where you go, if it's wild, you're going to have scorpions like this. They're going to be around. They're not dangerous to humans. They, they can cause some pain um, unless you have a very strong reaction. They're, it's just going to be like a, a bee sting, maybe even less. Um, you know, Jesse Story, who helps with all, these, all this mm -hmm. filming, got stung by one, and, and within five minutes, she was feeling much better. But scorpions, real quick, scorpions have have pedipalps in the front. Those look like pinchers in the front are called pedipalps to grasp their prey. They're covered with sensory hairs that can detect air movements of their prey. And then they've got that long segmented tail with the stinger on the end, which is what I think gives, gives everybody the heebie-jeebies. Certainly me, <laughs> I, respect, uh, I respect scorpions quite a bit. But scorpions are very successful. There are over 1,700 species. They're found in every continent except Antarctica. We only have, a, like I said, a handful of species in the panhandle, um, but over Overall, out of that seven, over 1,700 species, only about 25 of them are actually um were capable of causing death to humans. So around here, that's really not something to worry about. They're just um, predators that are feeding on insects, um, other invertebrates like themselves. This is what they're feed on. All right, uh, great information once again. And uh, I might have to go get one of those black lights and look around my house just yes, to see. Yeah, <laughs> they, they actually sell them for, for one of those. That is, is one of the reasons they sell these black lights is so you can check your place for scorpions. But sometimes things are best left unknown. Yeah, <laughs> I'd have to call an exterminator or something. But anyway, great information. Thank you once again. And, Thanks for uh, having me. We'll see you next week.